What up guys, Nakamoto Crypto here. Binance, one of the biggest crypto trading platforms in this space, are now under CFTC investigation over trading activities. Could this cause another Black Thursday market collapse? Stay tuned. Like and subscribe, let's get to 1000 subs. Subscribers. The crypto exchange Binance is reportedly being investigated by the US Commodity Futures and Trading Commission, the CFTC. This is over concerns surrounding whether or not Binance is allowing US investors to trade on their platforms. According to a new Bloomberg report on Friday, which cited anonymous sources, the CFTC is seeking to determine whether or not Binance has been allowing US residents to buy and sell crypto derivatives product while not being registered under the government agency's oversight. This report noted that the exchange hasn't been accused of any wrongdoing just yet. Could this be another BitMEX action? The Binance BNB token has reacted negatively to this news, dropping as low as 6% right after the news broke. Binance themselves have not responded to the block request for comment, but the CEO CZ has shrugged off the news on his Twitter page by stating simply, this is all FUD, fear, uncertainty and doubt. He goes on to say that there is no bull market without some FUD, so ignore the FUD and keep building. The news broke just days after Binance announced that they have hired Max Bacalz, who served decades in the US Senate and later became an ambassador to China. Max has been hired by Binance to help navigate the US regulatory landscape. Binance stated on Thursday that Max will provide the exchange with policy guidance and act as a liaison between Binance and the US regulators. From 2014 to 2017, Max also served as an ambassador to China under the former US President Barack Obama. This is also not the first time that the CFTC have probed a major crypto exchange. If you remember back in July of 2019, the regulators launched an investigation into BitMEX, who was at the time allowing US investors to trade crypto derivatives on their platforms. And that investigation has led to a formal indictment against BitMEX and its co-founders last year. So is Binance next? And is this going to cause a crypto collapse. Bitcoin on the other hand is doing fairly well as now citadels which was cited by the Bitcoin time traveler are slowly coming through. As now you can buy one third of a small island right now in Tampa Bay Florida in the US using your Bitcoin. 33% stake in a Florida island measuring nearly 10 acres is being sold for cryptocurrency via auction. The island, known officially as Pine Key and referred to by the locals as Birken Island, is situated between the Magdill Air Force Base and the Apollo Beach in Florida. This auction will take place between March the 15th and April the 2nd and all interested buyers are required to pay in Bitcoin. Investors can bid for the 33% stake or as little as a 1% stake according to the island's website. However, if one individual has the highest bid for the entire 33%, they will be the winner. So only the highest bid amount will be displayed and updated one or two times per day. The island is currently owned by five different partners, one of whom is selling his entire 21% stake. The other business partners are selling another 12% stake. The current owner purchased the island as a site to dock a floating tiki bar. The bar no longer exists due to a significant beach erosion. Some of the businesses on the island include a boat shuttle service private party venue and catering firm 
and also a camping service. The Tampa Bay Times reports that the island's business grossed nearly a $0.5 million back in 2019, which was its first and only full year of operation so far. There was little activity known to the islands throughout the entirety of 2020 because of the pandemic. Birken Island measured around 11 acres when the current owners purchased it but also has lost more than two acres of erosion since then. Official records puts its size to 23.62 acres of land but a survey that the Tampa Bay Times were given access to believes that the island is 8.9 acres of land. The current owners are stating that the island's land mass can be manually restored at a cost of $0.5 million. What are your thoughts on this Tampa Bay Island being able to be purchased simply with Bitcoin? Let us know in the comment section below. Like the video, share, subscribe for some daily crypto content. I have been Mr. Nakamoto Crypto and I'm out.